All new at 11, a dirty dining investigation revealing a new outbreak lurking in the Bay Area and the health department is doing nothing to alert the public. So we're taking action for you about parasites found in fresh produce, making people horribly sick. I have pain, I have nausea, I still have diarrhea, I have dizziness. Holly Green Pellegrini ate at Nordstrom Basile in Jacksonville on June 17th. Less than a week later, she got horribly sick and still suffers today. It took a toll on my, my time with my sister. Holly was diagnosed with a parasite called Cyclospora. Her symptoms so relentless and contagious, doctors forbid her from visiting her sister in a medical facility. For two months, I've had to, you know, I've lived with this guilt because I, I couldn't be with her. And she kept calling me and she didn't understand. And then she ran out of time. So right after that, she, she died, she died. And it was too late for me to reconnect and, and be with her. And it was, it was done, she passed away. And Holly wasn't the only one to get sick from that parasite. According to the state, over two dozen customers who ate at that same Nordstrom Basile also fell ill. The state health department wrote it believes that each patron consumed basil that was likely already contaminated with the parasite prior to its delivery to the establishment. And in Tampa, the Nordstrom Basile at International Plaza also had three people test positive for the parasite after eating there, according to the health department. In a special Dirty Dining I team investigation, we uncovered Florida had a major outbreak of cyclosporiasis that began in the summer months, but our health department never issued a warning to the public. According to the CDC, the parasite responsible for the nationwide outbreak made its way into the U.S. on fresh basil imported by a Mexican distribution company. Hundreds of people across 11 states have been sickened, despite the company recalling the basil on July 24th. It may last from days to weeks, sometimes even months. Dr. Beata Casanias is an infectious disease doctor for Tampa General Hospital and USF Health. Very watery diarrhea, abdominal pain, cramping, bloating, loss of appetite, weight loss, fatigue. Some patients also experience low-grade fevers. Dr. Casania says she's seen a huge spike in cases just this year. Normally, Florida has about 75 cases per year, but already in 2019, there have been more than 530 cases recorded. In the Bay Area, dozens of cases with the most in Hillsborough and Pinellas. And according to state inspections, Oxford Exchange in Tampa had two cases in June and August. And another case in June was discovered at Gianni's restaurant in St. Petersburg. When you fail to take the proper precautions to handle your food, you are playing Russian roulette with your patrons and the health of your patrons. Ron Simon, a national food safety attorney, has filed several lawsuits against restaurants in Florida over the recent outbreak, including legal action in Holly's case. Don't buy this stuff. It's not clean. It's not right. And if you do, then you, the restaurateur, the food service handler, have to take the precautions to make sure that before you serve it, it is clean and it is safe. Simon warns about the risks of imported produce. In order to get cyclosporiasis, you have to consume food or drink that has human feces in it. Uh, and that's gross. And it's unfortunate, but it's very, very dangerous. And Holly says she wishes the restaurant had done more to wash its basil before serving her because she's still suffering five months later. The pain at night is terrible. Sometimes I don't eat at all because I can't. Now, I reached out to Nordstrom Basile, Oxford Exchange, and Gianni's. No one wanted to speak on camera, but say they take these issues seriously and cooperated with the health department. Gianni's also stopped buying from its basil supplier. Read their full statements on our website, abcactionnews.com slash dining. And keep in mind, there is no vaccine for cyclosporiasis. So if you think you've been infected, get tested right away.